Good morning, everybody. It's 67 here, and today, me and this guy, it's a big one for us because today marks the beginning of the Christmas update event. And also, there's a brand new EX raid boss, a Deoxys, attack form Deoxys, which is coming to raid battles uh, December 20th, or EX raid battles. I only got like one or two normal Deoxys, so <laughs> we're gonna have to go a little bit harder on this form. Unfortunately, this form kind of this form has 43 defense. I'm pretty sure a Caterpie has higher defense than this Deoxys, but it's a cool Deoxys, so you know that's coming out. Looking at my schedule this month, it's looking like I probably will never catch the attack form Deoxys. We only caught like one or two of the normal one, and with this one, since I'm traveling between LA and the Bay the entire month, just because it's the Christmas season, I want to you know spend Christmas with the fam, and then I don't know where I'm going to be New Year's, and then the first week of January, I'm going to Portland, Oregon with Gilly, and then some other friends of mine and Jake and also we're gonna stop in Seattle so like I don't know if I'm ever gonna get the attack from Deoxys without trading it probably not also Heatran was just announced right now by Pokemon Go which is a fiery crazy Pokemon which I'm a little bit I'm curious about because if we have Heatran and raids the Snover are all gonna melt all right Heatran is here today at 1 o'clock p.m. and leaves next month January 15th so Get out there and rate them up. Cresselia is gone. I have like one or two of them. And most likely for tomorrow's video, we'll do a guide on uh, catching Heatran and kind of how to do all that. As for the attack form Deoxys, anyone interested, uh, it's gonna be 37,000 CP as a raid boss. Your best counters looking like Tyranitar with Bite and Crunch, Gengar with Shadow Claw, Shadow Ball, Mewtwo with Psycho Cut, Shadow Ball, Weavile with Faint Attack, Foul Play, Honchcrow with Snarl and Dark Pulse, and then Absol with Snarl and Dark Pulse. Basically your bug types, your ghost types, and your dark types. But mainly your dark type and ghost types. And it is a really easy, should be a really easy raid boss to take down. I don't know if you could solo it, but like, I think two people can definitely take it down with, you know, massive 43 defense. And let us not forget the Christmas update event starts today. And with that, we have a bunch of new generation four Pokemon spawning. We've got some new ones in eggs, mainly seven kilometer eggs. And today, the double candy bonus starts from the 18th to the 22nd of December, and that is double transfer candy along with double catch candy. And remember, you get one free use incubator until January 2nd, so keep spitting those stops to get your incubator once per day. And that is the news. It's a big day, exciting day, and today's video is about another challenge in the Trainer Battle series. Myself versus JT Gilly, we do a shiny versus shiny challenge. So tune in for that, give a sub to Gilly, link in the description, and hype for the Christmas season. Ho, ho, holy moly. Actually checking out some shinies as we get the cha-cha chicken going because today's challenge will be a shiny challenge. Shinies only is what we're doing today. Hey, everybody's got their food looking great. Not focusing, love it, but <laughs> focus right here. Okay, well, that was delicious. Hi. And then now it's time to throw some hands with the shiny only challenge today. I'm actually looking forward to this one. Before we get into the battles, let's hatch some eggs. We've got some 2Ks going up right now, and then uh, we actually have some legendary raids happening. Right now, that is the <laughs> Lugia and ho -Oh raids again. We've never seen these in raid battles. We probably should get that in the Pokedex today, and the Shinies are out too, which is actually pretty exciting. And there's one raid happening there, and then there's another over at the pier. at Santa Monica. You, there's raids ever. That was the only egg hatching right now. Nice. <laughs> Although, if we hit an excellent throw, we can mark the stamp for today. Excellent throw on a Lilith. I'm gonna actually try hard this right now. Come on, that's easy. That's easy. <laughs> They suck. Oh, catch, oh, okay, I forgot. Catch two Lilip or Anorith. Uh, that is for, I wanna say, Mel the Melton quest. Wow, that was helpful. Okay, if we can find another one of these. <laughs> Let me just look at that while we're just sitting here. Uh, Melton quest, two Ammonite or Kabuto. We should be able to find both of those over by the pier because they do spawn here in Santa Monica. And then two Lilip or Anorith. If we can find one more Lilip, just chilling. And that's a check mark on that little job right there. And we're on the raid. We have uh, a Lugia to start with, and the sun is right in my face. Figured while we were here, while we were here in Santa Monica, we'd get in at least one or two of these raids because actually, ho -Oh and Lugia are only in for the weekend. It was a really random event for Pokemon Go to kind of just like sauce on in there, so. I guess it's cool, we get some extra shinies. Obviously we've seen Ho-Oh and Lugia in raids. This is what, the third time? Or maybe even fourth that they've come? I think it's the third time that they come back to raids, which is about two times too many. <laughs> Everyone was very optimistic about like the, the possible Rayquaza return for shiny Rayquaza. That one we need. See, that would've been a cool like end of the year little shiny to kind of throw in there for a couple days. If that came out this weekend, I would've been so down for that. I would've been raiding like a maniac, along with Gilly too, because he's a big Rayquaza guy, along with the entire world, so. 
Uh, Niantic, shiny Rayquaza. But yes, today is the shiny challenge here for PvP and Pokemon Go. And remember guys, if you have any ideas on possible challenges or people that you want me to go up against in PvP, let me know in the comments. Uh, it's gonna be the thing here. Creativity is gonna be the most fun part about this series because there's endless variations of types of Pokemon and certain Pokemon to use and not use in battles. Like, we can do some really, really fun challenges. So if you guys have good ideas, let me know. And Battle on a Raid checked off. We can get our stamp for the day and let's see. Not a Shiny Lugia. Actually, Lugia, Shiny Lugia is one of our battle party people for uh, this little shiny challenge against Gilly, so I can't hit him. Okay, we're down to the last ball here on Lugia. I don't care about this legendary, so it running is not gonna be the worst thing. Um, if it was shiny, that would be a different story, but like, yeah, get out of here, Lugia. I listen, I don't even want you back in raid battles, man. Well, there's actually another legendary raid happening over by the pier, and that's where we will go next, and we need to get a battle in. Right, is your great league party ready? What, yeah, I'm oh, ready. We don't have to do it right now. Do you want to do it anymore? Uh, yeah, we don't have to do it now. Okay, we're not doing it right now, so tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna get the first battle in, which is the Great League shiny only battle. Okay, so now it is the Great League battle. My party's already on, I will send you a request to fight. We did a challenge one of the trainer battle series yesterday against Gilly. I lost, massively, two to one. So, we're gonna try it again today. Uh, actually, do we have a bet on this? Just shiny. We haven't decided on the rules yet, but like, basically the loser of yesterday got a Pokemon Evolved, and the loser of this challenge today has to trade the winner a shiny. We haven't decided what the rules are on who trades which shiny, but that's how that's working. So, loser loses a shiny, essentially. Oh, we're in? Yeah. Okay, okay here we go. First one, Charizard. Oh, you're trusty. Charizard, eh? Espeon, okay. I, that was one. I saw that as well. Ow, we're doing ow. an equal amount it's of damage. It's not letting me switch Pokemon. Thank you. you're also, yeah, you're oh, also it's kind of glitching there. Early Hello switch. Hello there, my Early switch. Guy. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and get a... Really? I'm going to get a Protect out of you while I can. Okay. Oh, I I'm actually not going to Protect because as much as Blast wow. hurts, not gonna be very effective, and I don't think you'll be able to charge up to that next one. I'm gonna, t I'm gonna let, I'm gonna let Charizard leave. Um, yeah, is he going? Is he gone? Is it rest in peace, Charizard? Let me get, a, let me get a couple more taps Keeping in here. Keeping him alive, eh? Let me get a couple Keeping more taps him in alive. here. I think I, I might, respect might it. Might be able to get a move out of you. There we go. Whether you let me or you know yeah, this yeah, is yeah. a win-win. We'll, we'll, we'll throw a little, we'll burn a little protection over here. I got no problem with that. Okay, Charizard shield go burn. Down. Charizard down. Yeah. Blastoise is hurt Should right be able now. To get the uh, that was an accident. But what do you whatever. Hello. Shiny Blast is gonna come in. <laughs> oh, come you off? got it off? <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm gonna, gonna let it happen. Too. I'm gonna let I'm it happen. Gonna, I'm gonna get destroyed. Is this a shiny v shiny? It's wow! Oh, I'm no. so happy that I didn't do much. Okay, oh. Blastoise goes down right there. I actually almost and don't know what to pick. You got one and a half left. Yeah, you got right? one and a half left. Absol, okay. Oh, I'm getting destroyed. We got a Hydro Cannon. His shields are low. I think he's down to, wait. No, I don't think he's uh, using shield. Yeah, yeah, he's used have... one shield. Oh my gosh. Absol wow. takes that one for the fam. <laughs> Jeez, man. What takes that one for the team. I'm telling you, every time I match up on you, dude, it's just like, in. even this, like, how are you doing this much damage on just like, I already <laughs> Oh, yeah, you already have a shield. All right. All right, boom. And tapping away. And GG's round one. Ah, all right. You know what? We took an early L today. It's okay. We did it yesterday, and then we lost the entire thing. So, very optimistic starting today. <laughs> Do I suck that bad? <laughs> I literally can't bet. Hey, let's try this out. Wow. Okay, so we found a Shinx raid that we're gonna go battle right now, and then we're gonna get the last two battles in. So, taking an early L, but it's all right. We've got um, two, well, technically one battle to come back to a tie-in. Two to win, <laughs> so my other leagues, my other parties are better. Yours is so much faster. <laughs> this is cheating. We beat the Shinx, and I'm going to check it. And it is not. I'm gonna have to find someone in my immediate best friend group that has a shiny Shinx available for trade. That's not gonna be an easy thing to do. I should have pine out this. I hope I don't catch it, don't catch it. And I think here is where we're gonna do the next attack, round two against JT Gilly, which could be the, the GG's, so I'm gonna really have to, uh, you know what, let me show you. We one hit this, although we have like almost 200 candy, so we're good. I have been using some Stardust, and actually, first of all, let me just get the stamp for the day. Nice. I have a couple Pokemon that I actually wanted to unlock second moves for, and it's in our Great League. Obviously, the Great League is gonna be the competitive league, it's gonna be the Silf Arena League, so it's gonna be the league that I'm gonna wanna have the best Pokemon in and Glenn from Secret League, aka the winner of the first tournament, showed that Alolan Metawak or Marowak is actually in the meta. This thing was it plowed through everything. But the thing about the Alolans, and they're probably gonna fix it very soon here, is that like it's treated statistically and type wise as a regular Marowak. So after that fix, I'm not sure if Alolan Marowak is gonna be that good, but we're gonna spend the 50,000 dust and get that extra move and use this competitively, I guess. Also, another fantastic one. 
is the Wizcash, and we actually have a 100% IV one that we got in Hawaii, which was fantastic. So that's only 10,000 dust and 25 candies for the extra move. We will for sure be getting that, and then we got Mud Shot. Mm. I actually want to see if I could use Mud Bomb. Nice. Okay, Water Pulse. I'll take that. So with the Wizcash, we have Water and Ground typing with a Ground type move, a Blizzard, a Ice type move, and a Water type move. This thing is absolute versatile tank. And then obviously right here with our Medawak, we've got Hex and then Fire Blast and Shadow Ball. So this thing's an absolute monster as well. And then Gengar as well. 50,000 Stardust. We're going to lock a brand new move for Gengar because Lick, Psychic, and Shadow Ball. This is a beast as well at 1487. So that's kind of like the, the meta squad that I want to work with right now. And the meta will develop as we battle more, but that's what we're working with there. Now, as for our Ultra League battle squad we're going to use against Gilly, it's going to be Shiny Kyogre, Shiny Lugia, and then Shiny Typhlosion. And I'll show you why. Because I don't have really great shinies, honestly. I mean, we could go water type, fire type, and then a Zapdos just to kind of like have all the types covered, but I don't know if I want to do that. I feel like having a little mix of some stuff could be fun. Oh, you know what? Actually, I'm going to swap this for the Shiny Amistar, because that is actually in our old Master League team as well. Shiny Amistar is not too bad. It's got Water Gun Hydro Pump, and it's Rock and Water type, so not the not the worst. We're going to use... Ah. I'm just going to assume that he's going to pull out some sort of Shiny Charizard, and we're going to have to take that down with the Amistar, and then we've got a little bit of psychic attacking as well. But I might even change up the Lugia. Now, you know what? We're keeping the Lugia in. That is the squad. We are ready to battle Gilly. That is a Lamborghini right there as well. Can you see it? Can you see it? You can see that green one. Wow. Nice. <laughs> All right. We're about to do uh, battle number two right now. Let me leave. Scooter. All right. Scooter's locked. Scooter's locked. Battle time. Okay, so now we're doing the Ultra League battle, so just kidding, we're actually hatching three 10Ks. And then we're doing the Ultra League battle against Gilly, and uh, I mean, you saw our squad, so that's gonna be a strat. And we got three 10Ks, first one trash. Egg number two. Actually, that wasn't a bad hatch, I'll take it. I, we still need to hatch a shiny. I don't want to use the S word too much in this video because, you know, it's not about shinies, but actually, it's about shinies. Trent, it's, it's gonna sparkle, and let me know if it does. You just made a light. Damn it. <laughs> it's bag on. Okay, cool. So now, Gilly can't log in right now, so that's kind of an issue. So we might have to move. Also, that was make an excellent throw, so we check that out. And then Ultra League Battle Scent. Here is the squad. This is what we're doing. I don't know how I feel about this. And the battle is starting. Here we go. I got a shiny Metagross start off. You got okay. Shiny Lugia. Wow. Metagross. Um, we're going to see what kind of damage we can do here. Out Meteor early. Mash, do we want to use it? Come on. You know what? I'm just going to let it hit. He's going to let it hit. Nice. Not very effective. Chunk, I'm going to learn type effectiveness, effective. and then we're going to get much better at this game. We've got Blast Burn coming here. Oh, anything. no gonna way. Swap he swapped out right before the Blast Burn. This freaking guy. Okay. Blast Burn, Typhlosion. You're going to use that on the Zapdos. Now is Zapdos. I can't I can't change out, so we're going to have to get this Blast Burn going up. We're going to use one more Protect. Probably I probably shouldn't have used that considering it's it's electric battle. versus fire, but it's alright. Yeah, There's the thunder. Protect. We're gonna protect. Fax, send a little well, blast burn in there. He's gonna um, save that protect, Zapdos. He is already think, kind of uh, destroying us. Protect. I'm gonna have to let this go. Idea, I'm not happy about that. Please right. let me get the one blast burn. We're not gonna we're not gonna protect it. We're gonna let it go. Gosh darn. This is frustrating because like ah, we're gonna go down there. We have to use this. Otherwise we're in trouble. Okay. Lugia, we're gonna take a hit. We're gonna take a hit. Oh my gosh, I didn't protect. I should have. I should have. Okay, you know what? What we can do an immediate future sight right now. He doesn't have any shields. So Metagross is gonna get hit immediately by a future sight. Which should do nothing. Oh great! Lugia's out, and then now it is going to just be our Amistar. Any meteor mesh immediately. He's gonna swap out and he's gonna bring in. A Moltres. I mean, interesting, interesting. We're gonna use a Hydro Pump right here against the Moltres, so we should be able to take it out. The Moltres is definitely gonna go down right there, and we gotta really hope that we can get the Meteor Mash Metagross down. Oh, did we come back? If you if you knock this, if you knock me down here, look at the look how close we are. Meteor Mash. No. Oh come on. Oh come on. You beat me. You, you did it. You did it. Okay, sweet. So we lost yesterday. Uh, we lost the Sinnoh Evolution. And then now today, with this much health, <laughs> we, uh, we lose the Shiny. Yeah, this close. Battle. We've got one more battle that in the Master League, fun. one more Shiny no, battle, no, and then I've got to give him a Shiny. Okay, so we kind of lost Gilly, not gonna lie. <laughs> He's, well, yeah, we should go look for him. <laughs> We're gonna go find Gilly, and then we'll get the last battle in. GG's though, I did lose a shiny, so we'll get that trade in too, but first, <laughs> saving private JT Gilly. No! Oh. 
Oh god, I actually hit you there, sorry. And we're back in... <laughs> Same spot to PvP. This is gonna be the Master League battle. I'm gonna send it. And this is gonna be our team. I don't know how good this is gonna be. I don't have a lot of faith in it, but we're locking it in. Ah. I, I gotta get out of this. You are definitely gonna rock me. <laughs> All right. Metagross. Oh, versus Metagross. Metagross to this Metagross. Is a, this is a fight we were trying to push, baby. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Nice. So this is gonna be Let's interesting. Go uh, Meter Mash, you gonna protect? Let it happen, gonna let it happen, okay. We're just gonna Meter Mash each other to death if this is how yeah. this is gonna work. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh boy, away. I'm lagging, I'm lagging, there we go, okay. Yeah, this is literally gonna be a Meteor Mash off. There's another Meteor Mash, yeah, no reason to use a shield here. Gilly is gonna, you're gonna survive. Oh, oh wow. That was, that was an accident. Interesting yeah. charge move attack there. You know what, I'm just gonna add insult to injury. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, dude. <laughs> oh, Don't have a count for that. Oh, okay, well, just you're kidding. doing not too bad. <laughs> Come on, like seriously? Yeah, third one off, uh, come on. <laughs> He's literally dead right yes. Oh my gosh. That would've been super well, at least we got that one down, and then we yeah. got a Stone Edge pretty much ready for Tarantar. <laughs> oh gosh. Again, save one. Uh, all right, there's a the Stone Edge. Okay. Ah, a little shield going in there. We're actually gonna throw in the swap. Gosh, I'm literally swapping so Pokemon. Can I swap, please? Can I swap, please? Okay, so Thank the you. Swapping okay. To Hello. Oh, oh wow, that's, that's doing a lot of damage. Here. Well, we're I actually also do this we're not same. doing terrible. All right, we Gilly's gonna go ahead and do. swap to you Dragonite. Have, you have oh my gosh, so dude, I don't know what I don't know what it is. I don't know what the strategy is here. I don't know how to be better, but uh, I definitely am not good. Oh my god. He's still got Dragon or Trap Tyranitar, which is gonna destroy me. I can't switch over. Oh, you're out of shields. Why are you so good I, at PvP? I, I, I'm just tapping. Jeez, thank God I wasn't in the competition because I would have gotten smacked up. Well, I did with by Nick. Two, oh, two. You know what? I am I am officially dedicating a majority of my time to studying type effectiveness in PvP. We're gonna come back and be better. Hey, GGs though. I was, I was GGs. More, GGs. More sure. challenges, of course. Oh, and a trade. Tons of challenges and the trade. Yeah, we're gonna toss him a, a shiny Wingle. Wait, what? Oh, and now it's unfavorited. It's from Yokohama, Japan. I'm gonna get some good kilometers. And that's the L that we're taking today. Shiny Wingle L. And I'm gonna give him a Raikou just in case if this is shiny or whatever. So, okay, not a no not lucky. lucky. Unfortunately. 289 shiny well, thank Wingle. thank you. You know what? Let's just do it right now. I, I, I don't know what I'm waiting for. Are you gonna, are you gonna evolve it? Yeah. I'll actually evolve with you because I don't have a shiny Pelipper. Yeah, here, you evolve I'll that. We'll do this too I'll at the end here because it is a shiny Pelipper and we don't really do. Oh, hold on. Alexa, turn the office lights on. Here we go. Yeah, we might as well just get a little shiny, shiny Pelipper action. Yeah, GG's to Gilly, man. I, I don't know what it is. I don't know what to do other than study type effectiveness charts, but like 3-0 today. <laughs> um, but that's the fun thing about PvP is that you can go in and completely destroy someone or go in and get completely destroyed and it's just gonna come down to almost luck on who picked the better Pokemon or who picked Pokemon that countered the other Pokemon better. It is what it is, we took an L today, but like, we also took an L yesterday. <laughs> totally fine though, things happen, and we'll come back with more challenges. If you guys enjoyed the challenge videos, make sure to let me know in the comments, and uh, also let me know any more challenge ideas that you guys have that you think would be fun in, uh, in PvP here. But hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you all in the next challenge episode, or next episode in general. We are currently 0-2 in the Trainer Battle Series, 2JT Gilly, so <laughs> we gotta come back with some fury, but deuces.